Oh, PO3, you bastard. I'll get you. I'll get you. Oh, this is supposed to be the spot where we just ended off in the previous scene, right? The four kind of like tombstones. How do I move? Botopia used to be safe for travelers. Now rogue bots block all the major roads. Okay. Thanks for the lore dump, I guess. <laughs> he's trying, he's trying. Ah! You're not used to seeing five lanes, are you? Less you can ever pull that off. Okay, more of a familiar sight now. Hmm. Hey, so this this world right now is being created by PO3 because he... Somehow I said I was going to be the new scribe of technology, but somehow he gained power. But does that mean that the previous, the very first cabin scene, it means that Leshy was in charge then? And then he decided to put everyone into cards because he had a camera and that's what he could do. <laughs> okay. Uh, ah, this is the energy bar, right? The energy requirement. All right. Okay. This is a more familiar looking space. I prefer this. Okay. 49er. Mm-hmm. Got an empty vessel, energy bot, double gunner, shield bot. I can only summon the empty vessel, basically. Oh. oh, I've got a hammer here too, okay, cool. Got two stacks again. I don't have that many cards, so there's not really too much I can do. Energy bot. Just put it down. Block some people. It gives me one energy, but then it also takes two to summon it. So I guess it just increases my maximum faster, maybe? Oh god. Oh god, okay. Oh my god. Ah! Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I think the empty vessel is like the new squirrel, right? It's kind of useless, but helps with blocking, I guess. Let's see here. Insecto drone. Airborne. Sniper. So sniper can hit whoever it wants. All right, let's see. And then I've got one more. It's a little bit different from the squirrels now, because we don't need to sacrifice anybody to draw new cards. We just gotta wait for our energy to fill up. Yeah, it's all empty vessels. Okay. I don't think I need that many. Five. Shield bot. First time it gets attacked, prevent the damage. Oh, so that could be good for blocking against the explosion bot then, right? Leap bot. Okay, okay. Duh, why bother? Hit him directly. Oh god. Okay. Okay, double gunner online. Right there, coup. Okay, now we're talking. How come it's still not hitting my empty vessel? Oh, because it's airborne. That's why. Whatever. <laughs> there you go. Oh, not teeth. We get money now. The best defense? Other bots. You carry a spark that can uh, reactivate old bots. Add them to your deck, you know. Then they fight for you. It's like those random events. <laughs> Except this uh, this map seems to be quite linear, not like what Leshy. Actually, Leshy's was not that... It was more atmospheric. This one is more half-assed, because the, the Game Master is not that into it. <laughs> the Dungeon Master. Swap bot. Swapper. After a card bearing the sigil is dealt damage, swap its power and health. Ooh, five damage. That could be huge. Busted 3D printer. Vessel Printer. Once a card bearing the sigil is struck, draw a card from your empty vessel pile. Why would I want that? More empty vessels? Uh, okay. Double Gunner. 
guess let's try to get... We already have one of these guys. High energy requirement, though. But we'll try it out. These power lines and stuff. Hey, but we're, like, technologically getting a little bit more advanced, huh? It's all, like, technical and battery needing. <laughs> You'll need more than a few reactivated bots. That is, if you truly wish to enact the Great Transcendence. But Tobia has some of the most OP items just lying around. That'll recharge your energy one turn. Pretty good. If you're smart, you'll use your items liberally. You'll replenish them at a waypoint, obviously. <laughs> ah, it's, a, it's a, one of those items. You want me to win? Is that why you're making this so OP? Like, uh-oh. If we win, maybe something good will happen to him. Broken bot. Detonator. Creature opposing it, as well as adjacent friendly creatures, basically die. Okay, so don't put stuff next to it then, and... Oh, but... <laughs> I can't put stuff here, I can't put... Wait, they cover the entire board. Both of them together. Basically. Ah, you're gonna be able to attack this guy and be okay because you have the nano armor. Shoot, okay. Well, first turn, all I can do every single time is the empty vessel. Which... I mean, there's no use putting it here because this is not gonna attack anyway. So I guess I'll just put it down. <laughs> oh god. Oh, so I shouldn't have put down the empty vessel there then, because now this guy's gonna be able to attack me. I'll put the energy bot here. Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god, okay. Um... We, we don't have that many cards, it's always gonna be the same cards. Not looking good. What do I want to do? If I explode... This guy, both of them- Oh, this guy's gonna live, shoot. Shield bot? Fine, two can play at that game. And sniper bot- Oh shoot, not enough. I can replenish my energy right now. Would that be worth it? Because obviously, if you wait until the full, because it replenishes- Replenish energy back up to the current maximum. It's all right. Yeah. Up to the current maximum. It doesn't give you like a full thing. Well, hey, try it out, right? Why not? The more you wait, the more useful it is. But then the more you wait, the more likely it is for you to lose, right? Uh-oh, I didn't see that guy. Uh-oh, that's a problem. <laughs> right. That's okay, that's okay, we, uh... Uh-oh, that might not have been worth it. Put this dude right here. We need one more, one more turn. Oh jeez, oh jeez. Okay, here we are, we're finally online. What do I want to do? Bifurcated... Bifurcated strike on the double gunner right here, and then killing that guy? Or should I just go straight for... No, I can't attack him. I'll do this. Good. Very good. The good thing about this is that the full energy bar comes back. Okay, you win. I concede. Let's move on. No, hell no. Hell no, why would I do that? Hey, is it just me or is your card glowing? Oh, because of the nano armor. Hell no. I think I'm gonna win anyway, but like, I'll put it here. Boom boom! Yeah, I get one extra dollar for not accepting your surrender, right? So we should probably not accept it. <laughs> These floppy disks are kinda long. Energy bot. Alarm bot. Explode bot. Hey, explain to me what they are, unless she was so good at the atmosphere thing. You're like, whatever. Alarm bot, annoying. The creature opposing a card bearing the sigil gains one power. Why would I want that? Why would I want my enemy to be stronger? What? That's weird. That's more like a bad sigil, isn't it? Explode bot? 
Uh, I guess I'll have my own explode bot, sure. I just don't know why I'd want this, though. Like, why would I want my enemy to be- Maybe I don't. Maybe it's just, like, a bad side effect. The real best way to fight back those rogue bots? Modify yours. Give them OP abilities. Choose a card from your deck. Oh, but what are you gonna give me? You're not gonna... Well, you want me to win, right? So I'm hoping you're not gonna do anything bad, but um... Maybe put it on something that isn't that high energy requirement so we can use it often. Sniper bot? Here goes. Let's see. Sharp quills. Once a card bearing the sigil is struck. Yeah, okay. Guardian. When an opposing creature is placed opposite to an empty space. Uh-huh. Sentry. When a creature moves into the space opposing a card bearing the sigil, they are dealt one damage. Sentry. The Sentry is more like an offensive version of the Quills. Quills... Actually, Quill is not good because this, uh, this card right now has one health, which means it's not going to be able to survive long enough for the Quill to activate, I think. Let's do Sentry. Satisfied? Not really, but thank you. Thank you for your very kind offerings. You're almost at the waypoint. Don't choke now. Alright. Tough love. Something something. More like toxic gamer mentality. <laughs> Ooh. The bridge. Oh, you've got an alarm bot. It does have a two, so we still need to be a little bit careful about it. Yeah, first turn is always the same, because we don't we don't have anything to do. Basically. Oh man. Oh man. It actually gave my empty vessel one damage just now, but it died before that even did anything. Oh, okay, so I can attack you back. I can kill you with my energy bot. What? You're a dummy. Yeah. I mean, that was only for one turn, but hey, better than nothing. In here? Okay, we're fine, we're fine. We're doing fine. Just hold on a little bit. Explode bot. Mm, maybe hold off on that one for now. Good. Oh, they've got a swap bot. Let's be careful. It only swaps if we attack it, right? So if we don't attack it... It only deals one damage, but then it'll be the <laughs> Well, obviously, having it there forever is not the greatest plan either, but... Hey, hey. Uh, not the best spot. The bifurcated strike is a bit wasted here. But it's good enough to win! <laughs> is he happy or not? This guy never seems happy. You made it to the first waypoint. Cool. Your items are recharged. Bots that you've destroyed in the area will stay that way. If and when you do perish, you'll be brought back here. It's an elegant system. Okay, so you're not like Leshy where I have to start from the beginning then. I mean, I guess that's sort of nice. Oh, it's like a um, fast travel point. Alright, cool. Thank you, I guess. Free money. Money? Wait. Gift bot. Double gunner. Sniper bot. Random card is created in your hand when this card dies. A random card from what pool? Let's try for going for diversity. This one doesn't actually attack, but hey, diversity, something, something, uh, essence of life, uh, celebration of things that make us different, blah, blah, blah. Woof, sorry, turn back. This bridge is totally busted. Go back. I'll need time. Beat a boss? That should give me enough time. It's a bridge lady again. Is this the same map? 
I can't even tell. It might be because that tombstone place was basically... Actually, it might be because there's a there's a bridge here, right? And we were crossing a lot of bridges to get here. Glorious commerce. Your robobugs are accepted here. What the hell are these? I can't afford it anyway. I've got 11. 10 robobugs? Pick one of your cards. Make my card stronger? If I can make the energy bot or the gift bot attack, that'd be so good. Let's give it to the shield bot though. I don't know what sort of selections they have here. Let me calibrate. Moving over. Sharp quills. Not the best one for one health thing. Sniper, you may choose which opposing sp Oh! Okay! Hey, we've got two snipers then. Why not? That's great. <laughs> we've got this like very old floppy disk machine. So yeah, I don't think it's quite current day then, is it? Good? No, it's like retro-ish. Oh. Well, I don't got money. Thanks, I guess. Man, we gotta go through all this again then. Eastern Botopia. Not much of value out this way. But you've still gotta explore here. You know, for the great transcendence. Which for some reason I want. <laughs> We're doing okay. I feel more at home in this sort of setup. Where I have to worry less about deck building and just more about the cards I have, of which I don't have that many. <laughs> Alarm bot. It's always gonna be the same. Just buying some time. Gift bot? I can explode the guy, but I can just use gift bot to attack him. Yeah. Right. Oh, but then I gotta wait for you to die to give me a card. Okay. Another alarm bot. All right. Shield bot. All right. Coo, coo, coo. Shield latcher. When a card bearing the sigil perishes, its owner chooses a creature to gain the nano armor sigil. Oh, okay, so when it dies, it gives nano armor to somebody? Interesting. This one already has a nano armor, so... Just thinking a little bit ahead here. Can you just die? I don't have enough, um... I can just put down the explode bot and then you'll die. Because I attack you, not because I explode on you. Shield latcher? Oh, I think putting the shield latcher here probably would have been a better move. Maybe. Actually, it doesn't matter because this guy's gonna die anyway. Yeah, it's so weak. Basically, anybody opposing it will die right away. I mean, it will die to whatever opposing it right away. There's so many alarm bots. This is good. Um, The sniper bot here. Still got room for an energy bot. But I also don't have space anymore. Yeah, this one's kind of useless. Because we were already one away from the maximum amount of energy anyway. Alright, cool. Energy bot, 49er, Insecto Drone. Do we have cards with higher attacks? Yeah, let's go for our 49er. The sprinter could be good for some situations. Yay. What even am I looking at here? Like, there's a whole bunch of random electrical equipment. Can I get up now? No. This guy's never gonna let me get up. Another broken bot. Explode bot. Yeah, just... All right. Oh, I'm not dead. Surprisingly. Broken bot. Let's put 
this guy right here to counter the swap bot. Yeah? Seems like a good counter to me. Mm hmm. Surprisingly, playing with five lanes versus four lanes doesn't really feel that different. I guess it's necessary because we can't really sacrifice things here. Like, sacrificing things, hitting it with a hammer, doesn't really give us an advantage, I guess. Alright, there's a 49er. Mmm, there's an explode bot. 49er is gonna die next turn. In that case, would I rather you do some real damage or eh, put it right here? Oh, maybe I should have put down the shield bot. Yeah. Oh God. Whoa. Okay, I'm very vulnerable right now. Like very vulnerable. I should take advantage of the sniper bot sentry status. That's all I can do. Um, if we keep waiting... Ah, it's only gonna be one because these guys don't attack. Okay. Oh, great! Fantastic! Fantastic. Energy bot, shield bot... We can choose to not attack it, but it's gonna kill us. And then... Gift bot over here. I'm trying to save the space for bifurcated strike. Hmm. How's the scale looking? Should we just attack directly? No, I'll get you. Ah, sentry! Oh no! Oh, sentry actually made this guy stronger. Shoot! Oh. It's kind of like Child 13, it switches back and forth. We... it does switch back and forth, right? Yeah, next time it'll switch again as well, but that was a bad move. Noted for future reference. Here's my bifurcated strike. And then... probably why not just do this as well? You can... you can die right away as well. Yeah. Almost there, but not quite. There we go, some nice excess damage. The core code is the same. Yeah, are you wondering about that star? You've been winning a lot, now you've got a bounty on your head. It's sure to attract bounty hunters. It resets when you die, though. Okay. The core code and the rules of the card game is the same, but then they get to, like, reskin it, basically, is kind of what it feels like. What? Oh, that's just one big loop. What the hell? <laughs> loop for no reason? There's gotta be some secrets here. A glitching star. <laughs> Really? This is too... This is too suspicious. What is the space for? It's nothing. Weird. Alarm bot, busted 3D printer, bolt hound, 2-2. Two, two. Oh, but it's very, very intense requirement. I just don't understand why it wants some extra vessels, man. I mean, without having to draw for it, using a turn to draw for it, I guess that's okay, it's not too bad. But it's zero attack though, I, I'd almost rather have the alarm bot. Yeah, but the alarm bot also dies right away, so it's kind of crappy. Eh, ball town. I don't really use that strategy a lot, using the hound. Here we go, here we go. There is an alarm bot that is looking very electrified. It has three attack. Is that normal? How did you get three attack? You had two. Wait, do they have different values? Or is there some, like, there's some reason why it's, like, sizzling right now? I don't know. That's fine. 
What's that? Another explode bot. All right, all right. Hold on. Oh! The name's Moon Klinsky. And I'll be taking that scalp of yours. Nothing personal, kid. You have one eye! What is this, the Wild West? The Wild West in the retro technology place? <laughs> Sharp quills. Oh my god, four. Four. Wah! All right, all right, all right. Hold on. That guy's gonna kill whoever sits in front of it. Maybe the bifurcated strike or... Uh, oh. Shield bot. Shield bot is good against the explosion. But for now, I'm okay. I can just use sniper bot. Because sniper bot is a better one to put down because of the sentry skill, I think. If something moves into the spot, it'll automatically attack it. Oh, it killed the bridge! Wait, the, the top piece of the bridge came down. Wait, what? Ooh, there's a weird little line here. Alright. Oh, but I took out the bifurcated strike spot. That might not be the best. That's okay, that's okay. Sentry drone. When did I get this? When did I get this? I don't remember this being in my deck. Did I get it just now? Uh, well, it's kind of useless now. Shield bot might be a bolt hound due to damage to it. Whoever attacks it will get hit with the quills. I've got nano armor. Hmm, I could just. The shield bot doesn't have too much. Nano armor is nice to block for one turn, but it's still gonna die. Doesn't matter, because I can just use these guys to, like, snipe the guy. Two damage. Like, no matter what I do here, it's gonna take two turns. No matter if I use Bolt Hound or Shield Bot. So I'll just use Shield Bot, I guess. Sure, make use of that Nano Armor ability. Or I can choose to ignore the guy entirely, which is, uh... How is the scale looking, actually? I can't see it. <laughs> yeah, I'll kill the guy. He's a bounty hunter trying to get me! We gotta kill the guy! What? Wait, why did my sniper bot just die? Oh! Oh, I hadn't- Oh my god, I hadn't even realized! For some reason, I was thinking the sharp quills only affected the person opposite of the, the guy. Oh, wh oh my god, I just killed my own guys for no reason then. That's really dumb. <laughs> but that's okay, we can fix this. For example, maybe by using a 49er. Or... No, we can't use the Bolt Hound yet. Okay, we'll do this. That was stupid. I could have just attacked the guy without doing that. Oh my god. Total misplay, as someone would say. If I, s if I put down the sentry drone here, it's gonna swap. No, you know what? Leave it alone. Just put it here, maybe. Oh, I thought I could move past- Oh. Oh. Yeah, that was a really big misplay. No, I thought you would be able to move away, but no, the quills activate immediately after you attack. Okay, that was big, big, big misplay. We can save ourselves by using Explode Bot. Maybe. Double Gunner. Double Gunner is gonna get killed by this dude. Okay, the problem is, we are on the verge of dying. And I think... Yeah, very unfortunately, I think we're gonna die here. Because... The minimum I need to survive this is another card that can block this guy. Like, I can kill this guy, but I need someone to block the one damage, but I can't because I can't put anything down. Right, so, um... Sayonara, I guess. Big misplay! Oh my god, the quills... I'll be taking that scalp another day. You ain't see the last of Moon Klansky. What? Yeah. Oh. Wait, the the bounty hunter is independent of winning the match? I killed the bounty hunter, but I lost the match. Boom! All your money's gone. Great work. You want it back? 
Then get back to this spot without dying again. Oh, damn it. He's still playing. Back to the last waypoint you reached. Just skip back to where you were, right? Not so easy. All the robots in the area just respawned. God. Oh, but you gave me a thing again. I, I guess that's kind of nice. All right, I'm back here. They just made me do the same battles again, so yeah. It was the exact same battles, same cards. Now we try this one again, come on. But without the Mounty Hunter. Yeah, that should make it a bit easier. Why do you have like electricity around you? Is that just the nature of this bridge? Is it just how this works? Oops. Okay, that is fine. This next turn, I am gonna... Um, put you down. Oh god, the explode bots. They freak me out, but we gotta live with it. Double gunner. Double gunner, it would be best if we could get this guy earlier. You know what? Put it right here. So I can attack that guy, or I can just leave him alone. Should I attack it? Leave it alone. Bye! Ah, but leaving it alone, of course, he does attack me. Shield bot, perfect. And then you, you, uh, you know what? I don't even need. Okay. We're fine. We made it through. Oh, the bridge drops down. That's so weird. Yeah, now we don't really have space anymore, so just keep going. Perfect. Alright. Oh, the next spawn point was right here. Items 100% charged. Bot spawner is 100% offline. What? Lame. The power is dead on this old thing. I'll let you get up if you go get a new battery. <gasps> You're allowed in the inspection room only. Just get me the battery from the inspectometer and come back. Oh my god. Print progress. Well, this is super retro. What's going on here? What are you? You're like... Sniper and alarm bot? 1-1? One, one. Are you a card? Wait. This is... You want me to create this setting? In the game? Actually, this is one card, right? I don't know what this means. Is this one single card? I don't have an alarm bot right now. Maybe I should get it so I can try to meet the requirements for meeting that. I don't know. Whoa! Ugh, how annoying. The other scribes' junk sometimes glitches in here. Try to ignore it. Oh, no, 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 no. This probably means I can probably, um... I don't remember the code from before. Shoot. It was something like... Like that, and then... <laughs> I don't remember at all! Oh no! Wait. Uh, maybe I should just... What? Okay. Four, four o'clock? Orobot. More junk. Want it? Okay, that, uh... Sure. Oh! What? Wind dot dot or a airborne dot dot? Can I take that? Oh, this actually works this time because um a cuckoo clock usually has stuff coming out at the on the hour, right? At noon. But what was that code that we did for the um back in the first section? Let me go look it up. Okay, it's one four five. But it opened the bottom though, so I'm not sure if we even still need this. One four five. Maybe the other way around. No. I don't even know what that means. Wow, that was <laughs> incredibly lucky of me, I guess. Uh, I'll keep it in mind. I'll keep it in mind. You're freaky. Why are we playing in this, like, weird... Oh, Mighty Leap. Oh, the rule book is here. 
It's just lying on some crappy place. Oh, here we go. We can do this. Here we go. Explosion. I can't move any of this. Four out of five. How about... Four out of five. Two out of five. Interesting. Oh, uh, we can't move this one, so it's supposed to... Whenever... If I attack this guy, if these two can't move. Which means the stuff next to it is gonna... Well, if I attack first, if I attack you, you're gonna die, you're gonna kill me, and then I'm gonna kill this guy. So, all four of these are basically gone. That's my understanding, right? Which, uh, that's why... Right, there's one from this column, and then one from this column. That's why it's two. And I need to make it more than two. Four. Why is that four? This is giving two, right? This is one. Why is that four? See, if I don't understand why the numbers are the way they are, that probably is an indication that my my core fundamentals aren't strong enough. Seriously, why is that four? Or three? This is three? Oh, because this doesn't count. This one is gonna get exploded. Right. Nothing in that row really counts. Yeah, this is two. Three. Okay, I understand why that's three. Four? Ah, oh, because this is nano armor, so this doesn't die actually. This guy doesn't die. This guy also has nano armor. Which means you cannot die, which means... This will be doing no damage. Explode some of my enemies, come on. They've got nano armor though. Doesn't really help here. Hey, hey! Mrs. Bomb's remote? Sure, take it. Drops bombs on every empty space. Tactical board wipe. Don't be stupid about it. Coo. What the hell are those symbols? I don't think I've seen those before, right? Amorphous, brittle. Green mocks. Oh, that's- oh! It's not colorful anymore, so I didn't recognize it. While a card bearing the sigil is on the board, it provides a green gem to its owner. Orange mocks. There's no color, it's only the shape. Attack conduit. Overclocked. If a card bearing this sigil perishes, it's permanently removed from your deck. Whoa, that's hardcore. Bomb latch. Choose a creature to gain the detonator sigil. Brittle latch. Choose a creature to gain the brittle sigil. Dead bite. When a card bearing the sigil perishes, select a file. Place damage on the scales according to the file size. What? Hostage file. No, give me the. I need the. I need the one. Uh, so this is orange, but what's this one? Is that like three gems? Gem detonator. When gem vessels on the owner's side of the board die, they detonate the creature opposing them, as well as adjacent friendly creatures are dealt 10 damage. When gem vessels on the owner's side of the board die. Okay. Some gem stuff here. And, uh... Oh, whoa, that just immediately turned into zero. From three to zero, my god. Oh! Ooh! I wish I could tell you what I did, but I just sort of randomly slid it around and it worked. Hey! Hi! Ah! Who is it? Who are? Who is this? Stimulation! Something other than darkness? Many thanks. Do with me what you will. Anything but that infinite darkness. Hey, buddy! It's nice to see you again. One of Magnificus's graduate students? Okay. No, uh, you wanted me to get the battery. I still haven't gotten it yet. Oh, I left those things turned off? That's fine. Just solve some easy puzzles. 
<laughs> they better actually be easy. Rotate the sigil until it's upright. Is that right? Oh. That was easy. Weirdly so. Whoa! We've got a camera watching us. Select all squares that contain cards. Oh, this has the board but not the card. What is that one? Select all squares that contain cards. No, what? Oh, come on. Are those not cards? Those are cards, aren't they? What? Wait, what is this? This is like a CAPTCHA test or some- What? <laughs> yeah, it feels like a robot CAPTCHA test and I'm failing it. Uh, there we go. Select all squares that contain cards. What is that stuff? Am I- Am I a robot? No, I have human hands. I've got human hands. What? Yep, that's it. Bring it over. Okay, we've got another like puzzle room here. We need to like periodically look around and see if stuff changes, but for now maybe just Get back. Oh god, can we turn on the lights here? It's so freaking dark. Yup, thanks. That's fast. That should do it. Back to the game. Eastern Botopia. All right, cool. Oh. What? Where did you get that? Oh, was that the key we got from that house? The house with the two people? <gasps> what is this? This is not one of Botopia's uberbots. Where did these repugnant mushrooms come from? What is this strange feeling? Arr! We have gained control of the robot! Complete control! We must now experiment. We must play a card game. Wait, those are the people again! Two into one. Two into one! Oh, hey! Hey, if we're meeting- Oh, frick, I don't have an alarm bot though, very sadly. Because I was thinking about that puzzle that we had on the side there, right? If I had an alarm bot here... Maybe I could combine that with a sniper. Oh, but I, I don't, so I guess... There is an alarm bot here. Alarm and sni- mm. Anyway, we should deal with the problem at hand right now. Oh my god, Leap Bot. It's got the Alarm Bot sigil and Mighty Leap. What the hell? Okay. Hey, even the colors of the cards changed. It's like or What? Okay. Ah! It's not my Alarm Bot. What was it? It was Alarm Bot on the left and then Sniper on the right, right? I'm pretty sure. Can we make that happen? I might have to die. Like... Because it feels like it's pretty deliberate, but we'll see. Look, because uh, this board, they move people right, right, right. This is not a normal board. How do I... Hmm. You guys can't move now. Okay, I, I don't think I want to defeat this guy, actually, because if I do that, then these guys will combine, right? And I don't really particularly want them to combine. <laughs> yep. Lonely Wizbot. When one of your creatures is placed in a space, a card bearing the sigil will move towards them as far as possible. Clinger. You're two. You can defeat this guy. Okay, I feel like that'd be good anyway. Oh, I don't have enough energy. Shoot, that's right. Ah! Okay, that was fast. This experiment is incomplete. We need more time. We must restore the robot. You must return. What just happened? Where am I? 
Oh, you lost. Back to the waypoint then. Ah, oh, okay. No, I'm pretty sure that's what they want me to do. They want me to create this creature here with one al alarm and sniper. But if it's whether it's going to be one and one, I can't guarantee. Is that really something I decide though? I could go about it right now, but I have so many cards that I don't even I haven't even tried using yet. Um Okay, let's try once more. We can come back. We don't lose anything anyway. Because we were at the waypoint already. I have a vague memory. Why do you keep coming back here? We are back! We are back! Oh, this is like the real life version of the people we saw in that house. That's so. Hmm. Okay, we have an alarm bot here. This is something we would like to keep having. So maybe if I want to stall for time, what I should be drawing is the empty vessels then. Just to stall a little bit, you know? And then I gotta wait for a sniper bot to come from the other side. Basically. But I don't have- Oh jeez, I'm already dead. I'm already dead, man. Don't even think about like trying to do extra stuff, like I am literally just... Dead. <laughs> um... Yeah, I think we can use it right now because the waypoint, if we get respawned there, we'll just... Shoot. This is a lame pick though, just doing that. Um... Just hang in there, alright? Oh, shoot, what? Why did you get a one? I thought you had a zero. Oh, because of the alarm bot. Ah, oh, so the alarm bot, we can't really do anything with it if we wanted to stay there. Shoot. Right, and then you also have the alarm attribute. Hmm. Okay, this, uh, we need more time. You must return. What? How do we end up battling? Recalibrating. I think I know what I want to do here, but I'm gonna come back later then, okay? Because it feels like... It feels like not right now. Because I need to like, maybe build up my deck a little bit more. So for now, I'll just move on. Revolting! Yeah, sorry that you have to see this. It's the last area in Botobia that still has life in it. That stinking, squirming mass of imperfection. Uh... <laughs> Oh no, you came at, a uh, just the wrong time. This generator is about to explode, or something. You have to recharge it before that happens. It's a race against the clock, you'll see. What? So it's not a scale today, but this... this thing. Annoy FM? Oh, it's gonna make me stronger so I can help... so I can fight, okay. Wait. Well, I gotta put down the empty vessel. But I don't want to destroy you then. If I have a bifurcated strike here, that would be good. But as it stands... No, I'm not even gonna destroy it. I'm just gonna put it... You know what? Just, uh, just pass. No. Gift bot? Energy bot. We should put down energy bot. Shoot. Pass. Oh my god. When my face says zero, you lose. Alright, no pressure. Yo, I need the double gunner. Stat. Mm. Like, if I do that, that's not really gonna- that's gonna destroy this guy, but I don't want that. Orobot. Oh my god, Orobot, you take you take so much to summon, you're not worth it. You're not worth it. But back in the cabin area, you were a rare card, so you probably have some hidden effects that I haven't figured out yet. But I haven't really like put any effort into trying to figure you out. That's the the problem here. Alright, shoot. Shoot. I don't think they're even gonna try to like 
Yeah. I need some, like, actual attacking cards right now. Oh my freaking god, this is horrible. You know, because we got so many cards earlier, our deck is full of random crap now. That I can't do anything with. Like, this is just useless. You're running out of time! I know, I know. Okay, there's my double gunner, but you might be here a little bit too late. I don't know how I can even... I can't do anything here, man. You know what? You need to go. Oh, I could have done that! I didn't even re... Okay. Should have done that earlier. Okay, you... I need to destroy you. Us with you, because I don't want that thing to die, because I want to make it... I want to take advantage of... The... Um, bifurcated strike here. Let's see, I'm gonna use this even though we have... Oh my god, I can't freaking summon anything. What a waste. Yep. Put it... Right here. Three. That's all I can do. Oh, we might be okay after all. We might be okay. Sniper bot. Perfect. Yeah. Come on! Fuck! We got it, we got it! Wow, great. You recharged it before it exploded. If I could clap for you, I would. Alright, cool. Choose a card. Stimulate me, says Lonely Wizbot. Eh, you are pretty easy to summon. You wouldn't be the worst choice. Great attack. Great attack. You know what? Go for it. Why don't we? What do we have? Unkillable on a two energy one. Not bad. Sniper. Sniper also not bad. Sentry. Sentry maybe... Sentry could be really saving a card that only has one health. Yeah. Oh, all of the cards have that little thing on the top. That's what it is. It's nothing. Um... Unkillable. I'm gonna go for unkillable. Not what I would have picked. Okay, great. You're not me. Thanks. <laughs> for money! Alright, we, we gotta click around, man. There's There could be stuff around here. That place where we had the diagonal, it was right at the waypoint, right? We gotta remember that. Sonia, Sentry Drone. Grizz. Transformer. At the beginning of your turn, a card bearing this sigil will transform to or from Beast Mode. Beast Mode? Hey, earlier, didn't I have like a turn where I had a Sentry Drone? Oh, but it's probably from the gift box. I don't actually have that card. I see. I don't think I need it though. I've got a sniper bot with a sentry, which is pretty nice. Uh, This guy seems interesting because he's 0 and 4, so I'm gonna... But that's a very high requirement card. Kind of worried about that. I think I'd rather have a card with lower requirements because right now it just seems like... My deck is expanding again. It's expanding. I don't necessarily like it. Ancient Fur. OUI77? Transformer Sharp Quills. Hmm. Just put you down here for now. I feel like our goal for every single round here is basically try to build up energy as fast as possible. Stimulation. Yeah, buddy. You gonna be okay? I don't want you to... Um, die. Because that guy might kill you right away. Oh, but you're unkillable. <laughs> you are unkillable. I'll put you here, though. Oh! Yes! Yes! Uh, this guy... Did you turn? You're 2-2 two, two now. Ooh. 
Uh oh. The balance tips. Oh, now you turn. Oh, you're like a porcupine. A quill! Quill! That's what you are. Or a bot? <laughs> Maybe not right now. Damn, both of these are gonna kill my sniper bot in one hit if I let it down here. Which is something I kind of want to avoid right now. Maybe energy bot? Just uh, hang on for a sec. And then of course, lonely whiz bot. I can put you down as well. You'll die, but it'll be a worthy sacrifice. Good. Hey, hey, welcome back, Lonely Wizbot. Welcome back. Needing you as well. So if I put you... You're airborne, which means you're not gonna attack my sniper bot. Which is what I'm really hoping anyway. Bolt Hound, Lonely Wizbot. Oh, this is great, I love it. I love it. You have a guy behind you, which you're gonna come in and kill me, so I'm gonna put you here then. Oh, yes! Yeah, dude. I can kill you, actually. I don't need to... Um... Hmm. You're not gonna... You're not gonna attack me, right? Because you're airborne. Right, so I'm just gonna kill you. Oh! Oh, but now it's gonna attack because the airborne- the airborneness is gone with the transformation. Something we have to be careful about. More quills. Holy crap, this board is getting full! What are we gonna do? Put down Bolt. Oh, the nano armor is gonna save this guy. But I gotta attack it though, otherwise I'm gonna be dead. Better kill one more. At least we got rid of the nano armor. Oh, jeez. Yikes. Double gunner. Oh, we need to get rid of the ancient fur, otherwise this is just not going well. Might want to put down two cards just to like stall for some time. Thank you, Lonely Wizba. You've been a godsend so far. Quill's gonna try to, like, attack, so you hear. I am feeling stimulated! I'm glad, friend. I am glad. I could try using the bomb. You turn back. Okay, so the gift bot I can actually destroy whenever I want with hammer. But uh, this turn, I probably want to summon something. But, ugh, attacking trees is so useless. Aurobot? <laughs> I never try putting you down anyway. We okay? Dang it. Oh, the Orobot also comes back. Right, we have a whole bunch of stuff that just comes back to our inventory, which is not the worst thing that could happen. Mm-hmm. Hey, your stats changed. The numbers changed, didn't it? Hold on. Is that like your special ability? Whoa, wait, wait, wait. We need to defend against a whole bunch of stuff here. How's the scale looking? Oh, we're gonna win. We're gonna win in that case, but let's try this one again. Oh. That might have been a bad move. Okay. It was 1-1 one, one before, right? And now it became 2-2. Two, two. And it's unkillable, so maybe- yeah, maybe that's a special thing. It keeps going up. This here, g-girl? Prospector. I were just about to mine it. Guess all I needed were a kick in the pants. One of your cards is about to gain an alter ego. As a beast. <gasps> and you get to choose which card and which beast. It's not that complicated. Oh. Alter ego? What if we put it on something like the gift box? Something that I wouldn't really mind losing? I don't know, or the 49ers? Something low requirement. 
explode bot. Hmm. Well, the gift bot, I want a gift every single time though, so maybe not this guy. What about you? Okay. I feel a little bit hesitant to rely too much on the high energy requirement cards. Which beast will live within your bot? Oh. 3-1. Oh, 3-1. One. 1-1. One. One, one. Why would I want 1-1? One, one? Airborne, maybe? Oh, 2-1. Two, 2-1. One, two, one. And then... Oh, the touch of death! The adder, 1-1. One, one. Straight up better attack, or... Situationally interesting. Okay, you know what? Get the freaking touch of death. Hell yeah, turn into a snake! 49er? What is 49 anyway? <sighs> really? Alright. Yeah, whatever, man. It's... Keep judging my plays. Hmm? Grizz. Yeah, if we put it on the empty vessel, then... That would have been even better, but it wasn't a choice. Mm-hmm. Oh god! Whoa, that's a, a freaking grizzly bear! Whoa, shoot! 4-4. Four, four. Turns every turn, though. Um... It transforms at the beginning of your turn, but not the first turn when I put it down. So if I put this down right now... It'll move? But that guy's probably- oh, this guy's airborne. Oh, so he's not gonna kill you anyway. Like here? I'm envisioning you're gonna attack, you're gonna transform, or you're gonna move, and then you're gonna transform. Hopefully. Oh, but at the beginning of my next turn, not this turn. Mm-hmm. There we go. Oh, yeah. Okay, okay. Now we're getting somewhere. That? Surprisingly actually worked out sort of the way I wanted. This guy's strong. The four is strong. Three. Guess I'll put you here for now. 49er, you can just attack that and... Do I even want to try to attack that guy? No, because he's zero right now. Leave him alone. Wait, he turns every turn though. Well, we'll worry about it next turn. <laughs> oh, damn. Okay, now we can kill the explosion and it'll kill the grizzly bear right next to it. Next time. Energy bot? One more, but you take three. F shield bot. Put you here. Oh, both of them I can aim. Right, right. Beautiful. You get so much flexibility with two snipers on your team. Hey, man. What's up? What's up? So I was just gonna put you down here. Which is a win already. Perfect. The guy who used to live here was totally sloppy. I don't mean he didn't keep a clean cabin, it was his plays. He'd make misplays left and right. <laughs> Cared more about lore and flavor. Hey, Leshy was great. You get it, right? Perfect strategy is all that matters in a card game. Well, you're a robot, so do you ever make misplays? I imagine not. Give me a place to spend my money, man. Oh, right here. Grizz, Quill, Insectodrone. I would like a Grizz of my own. That seems very strong, but the... Oh, I'm just worried about having so many that's like... If the fight lasts for that long... Well, the good thing is, every single turn we can summon one of them. We just gotta last until that long. Maybe more energy bots is a good thing to try to like, get me up to that spot faster. But for now... Uh, I've got a Sonya. Quill? Grizz? Let's get Grizz. 
My card deck is bloated. I'm not the traitor or anything, but there's gonna be a little give and take here. You'll have to trade one of your cards for one of these. What? What if I don't want to trade? I don't want to trade. I don't like any of these cards. Insecto drone? I don't usually rely on airborne stuff. I just want to ram through everybody. But you know what? We'll just do this. Okay, what will you give me? You can have my bolt hound. What did you say? You can have this. Yeah. <laughs> Great trade. Fantastic. <gasps> Another one. Pick one. <laughs> yes. The reason why I don't want to put a beast mode on this guy is if you turn, you're not going to have the unkillable perk. So I don't think it's a good idea to put it on this guy or Orobot. <laughs> Orobot. Everyone's names are like modified. Beast mode. Beast mode on the gift bot. Make yourself useful. How about... Yeah, I mean, that could be... Uh, the gift... Well, ah, the gift, you only get it when it dies. So if it dies as the other guy, you're not gonna get it. But this one, you get the energy as soon as you put it down. So you know what? Put a freaking beast on the energy bot. Hell yeah. Here we go. And I can choose what beast. Okay, let's choose a high... Airborne, huh? Let's choose a high attack one. Gonna look down on my energy bot? No longer. Does that look right? You're always so sad. Do you ever even do anything happy? Oh, this feels like... Feels like I've had enough card games for a lifetime. Oh my god, this is, um... I mean, it's fun. I find it fun, even though I'm not good at it. So I guess that's a good thing. Empty Vessel. Standard first move. Oh dear. Oh no, it's airborne, so that didn't help. Energy bot, come on, you can do something. No, no, no. Energy bot. Oh, it blocked the... the fur blocked it. Yeah, energy bot, come on, yeah, yeah. Come on. Hell yeah, lonely whiz bot, my man. My man, we should probably do something about this, though, because this guy's not gonna do anything. So many sights! Yeah, yeah. Okay, we gotta be careful about that. Gift bot? Let's get rid of the fur if we can. Oh, we can- <laughs> That's a gift bot! It's not gonna do sh <laughs> It's not gonna do anything. <laughs> so, uh, you know what I can do? It's not gonna hit me either, so I'll just get the card right now. Skilla Latcher. I can choose a creature to gain the Brittle Sigil. Why would I want that? You have an attack though, so... Oh, I don't have energy. Okay. Amazing. Oh, that's... Oh, man! Oh, man! My guy got spared, but not for long enough. Double Gunner. Explode bot. If I can kill this guy, get this guy down here, that would be good. Brittle. Well, you've got a one, right? Mm. How does your sigil go again? When a card bearing this sigil perishes. So I'll put you right... How, are I... How can I make you perish? I almost want to make you perish. No, just attack. Just attack normally. Oh, we are on the verge of death, by the way. Maybe we should have been using this thing, huh? Empty spaces. I don't want to put... the explode bot down. It does attack. Oh, it does attack, though, so that's good. Attack that guy. Am I gonna be okay? Lonely Wizbot, counting on you. Oh, you died! 
Oh, okay, you died because this guy's an explode bot, that's right. So I can put the brittle... Oh, I can put it on my enemies, too! Interesting. Interesting, because that means I can kill one of you right now. Mm, I don't think any of these are going to survive, though, so maybe this guy. And then when it attacks... Okay, it got killed. It got killed. All of my energy is online, but we are also on the verge of death right now. Double gunner, nowhere, don't have a good spot for it. Could do the explode bot, but you're close to... Um... There's no one behind the fur. Swap bot, sniper bot. Okay, well, you're, you're airborne right now, so you're not gonna attack me, so I'll put you here. Over damage. Yeah, tipping the scales back a little bit. Uh, uh. Oh, hanging on by a thread. Or a bot. Swap bot will help me hang on a little bit. Can I use it to go against you? But do I want to put down like... In terms of tipping the scales... Oh, but that's a four. Four and a two. Well, I can get these two. Um, it might be better for me to... I can't destroy this. It's gonna hurt somebody. Might be better to, for me to put down two cards instead of the swap bot. Like that. Should I kill it? Or should I tip the scales more? This guy's gonna hit me for a four. Well, let's... Yeah, we gotta kill it, otherwise my double gunner will die. Tipping it back a little bit. Ah! Ah, okay, okay. Sonia, swap bot. Sniper bot can still do some work here. If I wait a little bit. Ah, uh, the aura bot. Hey, I want to kill the aura bot again though, just to see what happens. But it might not help me with trying to regain spots on the scale. Just keep shooting. Keep shooting. Right, he's super weak now because he doesn't have the grizzly bear. Now he does. Ah, the Ouroboth, three out of three! Oh, so we want this thing to keep dying then. That would be a good thing. Bolt Hound. So next turn I can use the sniper bot to kill both of them. Which means right now I should focus on stuff that'll let me attack the guy directly. Uh-oh. Okay, Explode Bot might be killing all of my guys here, but I've got a chance at... Is that good enough? Oh, that was a long battle with a lot of going back and forth, but we did it. Your items are replenished. And those bots back there are permanently offline. Cool. Foul backwater. I've never used the bot- the bomb thingy. Should probably use it more often. Eerie. This uberbot just sits here in perfect darkness. Is it just waiting for challengers? Maybe it's letting its photos develop. Photos? The next boss is pretty cool. You'll actually need to think about your plays. Oh no. A whole new mechanic. Okay, where are those files? Unpacking photographer.zip. You kind of look like a core from Portal. The lens is my instrument. You as well are my instrument. You will aim and I will capture. What does that mean? Out of the deck, into the hand. What does that mean? Uh, maybe if I put down good stuff, it's gonna- Wait, oh, it didn't put down anything. 
Well, don't give it anything then. Freaking just put down an empty vessel. Oh! This is my friend. You will aim them. You will produce a photograph. Or you may decide not to. That is your choice. What? No photograph in memory. I can choose to or not to. Well, I have an empty vessel here. Do you want to... Can I move this? I don't think I can. My friend will remember that photograph. My friend will allow you to use that photograph. To what end? You will see. Okay, so either I've done something really good here by not giving him anything good, or I've done something really bad here by not giving myself the best of what I can have. <laughs> we'll see. He did it at the very beginning though, so there was nothing else I could do besides empty vessel. To use when? You will see. Aurobot. Three out of three. Okay. We've got the explode bot. Touch of death and sentry. Are you kidding me? Oh my freaking god. So wait, I can't move into that space then. Wait, no, it's gonna move down here. Oh, I've gotta put stuff down right now because otherwise... Why don't I just use the bombs to clear, clear them all then? Would that be okay? That seems to make sense in my head. Let's see if it actually does. Uh, this guy or the explode bot? Let's put down Lonely Wizbot. Yes! Attack! Hey, you have a clinger thingy, right? Are you gonna move over? Yup. Oh? Oh! I can revert back to another state of the board. Okay, so I think it's a good thing then. I think it's a good thing that we got rid of it. Now we gotta- we wanna focus on attacking if we can. It's gonna be the Lonely Wizbot again. And pretty much nothing else. Yeah. How often are you gonna let me do that? Lonely Wizbot? Yes, I would love to have this. This kind of feels like you're letting me win though, because you're always doing it when I have stuff and you have nothing. Is that okay? Almost feels a little bit cheap. Bolt Hound. Wait, Energy Bot does have a B state now. You clinging? I can put down the Explode Bot, but I'm not- Yeah, I do, I do. No! You idiot! Don't do that! <laughs> God damn it. It shouldn't have done that, now I might die. But it's unkillable, so I guess it's okay. Oh yeah. I can choose to go back or not go back. Mm, I will take a... I think I will take a photo. I can't store photos, right? I'll take it. But I'm not gonna go back. Oh, that's a very interesting mechanic here. I've got four cards, you've only got one. I feel like that's gotta be a pretty good thing here. How about we try the Ourobot? You're gonna... Yeah? That's phase one, of course. You have dealt me a blow. You have. You have dealt me a blow. Recalibrating personality matrix. Hmm. I want you to revert back if possible, but that means my ore bot's gonna be gone. I think that's the implication here. That's okay. That's only one card. Why not? And then... I... Yeah, I gotta be careful about the cards I put down then, because... Hmm... Well, I think we're okay though, overall. You just hang in here for a little bit. I can put down a sniper bot, but you're gonna... Die... To the dude. Yeah... 
pass. Perfect. Sweet. Cool battle. But I felt like that mechanic was more for you losing than actually helping you win. Which might be what PO3 wants anyway. Remember your side deck? That useless thing with all the empty vessels? It's about to get less useless. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Your pick will be installed on every empty vessel card. Oh, sweet. Airborne? No. Airborne blocking. Nano armor? Quill. The quill! The quill! Yeah, because I always put this down. If you can do some damage, that would be amazing. Interesting. Not sure that was right, but they all have sharp quills now. Thanks! All right, sweet. So that was one of the four bosses, I guess. Ah! Guy! First the batteries and now this. New card. I told you, use OBS, stop. Oh God, oh, this looks scarier. Oh, this is from all the way back in... on the second. When he first bought the cards? Well, hello there, card gamers. Um, looks like my garage sale hunting days have finally paid off. Yeah. Yeah, baby. What you guys do this? You know what that is? You know what that is? Vintage packs of inscription. Four of them. I don't know if the woman knew what these are worth. I mean, I felt a little bad buying them off of her. But I mean, she's probably doing okay living in this part of town. I mean, it's like, it's a nice part of town, you know? And uh, she would have thrown them away if I hadn't come by. Right? Right. Okay. Big pack <laughs> opening video incoming! Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! You probably ripped her off. <laughs> but little did you know, this is the beginning of your worries. Mrs. Hobbs? Hi, my name is Luke. Well, it's very nice to speak with you as well, Mrs. Hobbs. Um, listen, I was at your garage sale the other day and I... No! No, everything's fine, thank you. Um, I was just wondering if you remember those playing cards that you sold me? Those... Oh, I was trying to trace it back. Yes! Yes, those ones. Inscription, yes. They were your daughters? Would it be possible for me to speak with her? She passed, isn't she? Oh. Oh, no, I'm, I'm so sorry. Oh, it was a while ago. That's still... Terrible. Oh, it's nothing really. I'm, I'm sorry to have bothered you, ma'am. Her name was Casey. <gasps> That's a lovely name. What? Sorry, what? She worked for Inscription? I mean, she worked for oh. Game Funa? Ma'am, would it be possible? I see. Okay, yeah. Um, do you think it'd be alright if I called you back later? I'm just trying to get to the bottom of something. Okay. Okay, thank you so much. Okay. Alright, have a good dinner. Bye. Casey? That was one of the people in the crypt and one of the people in the beginning cabin area who had a death card. What? I, wait, wait, wait. Did she die while she was working on the job, or did she just die of natural causes? Because 
We know people are trying to like hunt me down and stalk me at my door and stuff now. Casey. Yeah, um... Oh no, what's happening what's here? Because presumably she's the one who put the floppy disk into the woods. And then she put the coordinates on a card and put in a card pack. Presumably. But now she's dead. Hey, the more I look at this, this might not be Windows 7. What if it's like Windows Vista or something? Because when I look at the, the monitor, it's kind of like an older style monitor too. So maybe like 10 years ago? Not really current day, but also not that old. Oh, same day. These are all the same day except for this one. Oh, what's this one? This article's mentioned death or injury. Oh my god. Oh my god. No one was killed at the facility, though tragically young video game developer Casey Hobbs died from fire-related complications. What? Fuck. She was working late at the facility, performing quality assurance on behalf of her employer, Game Fuma. Well, I think he's seeing the camera bug out. Why is it bugging out like that? It's like it knows. Ah, this is so... Uh, okay, so she died on the job. Okay, great. Great. Wonderful. Fantastic. Yo, what is happening with my camera? It's freaking out. 3K. Mirror. Ooh! Are there clues in there? I don't know. Did anything change between the... I don't think so. I don't want to see this again. Okay, uh, this might be... What is that symbol? A pig? Pig, 3k pig. It says mirror here, mirror or something. Oh god. Someone is here. My phone's in the other room, so if I die before I can call 911, use this tape as evidence. Whoa! <gasps> so who has this camera right now, then? It's weird, because whenever we play periodically, you get the voice being like, Oh fuck, I just made a misplay or whatever. It's like he's playing right now, right? But then, like, these are obviously recorded in the past? Or maybe it's just reenacting him having played that part. I don't know, but those people... Those people want to hunt him down. Whoa! What does that say? My call... My call... Just... Two, two. Perhaps... Perhaps with a three as an E? Blood, dollar sign, letterbox with a three as an E. My call... My call just? Is that a two or an I? Okay. Maybe we should remember this? This seems too long to be a password, though. Oh, I don't like this. I don't like this. Okay, now I really don't like this. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Uh... Okay, we good? Camera? Yeah, you know what? Back when Windows Vista was around, OBS was not made yet. So okay, I'll forgive you. I'll forgive you for not using OBS. I think back then, Let's Plays wasn't... Like, I mean, the, the concept of Let's Plays wasn't even that popular. What were people using? Fraps? Yeah, we got one guy. Ah! It's the same map! Look, it's the- this is the Leshy's cabin. And then this will be like the grave, the crypt, and then PO3's thing, and then the tower. Right, okay, so... Just go back now then? We can walk down. Oh, oh that works. Thank you.